How dangerous can social networks be for a minor? Many would think that security has increased in this manner, but the truth is, it is still very far from being harmless for kids. And convincing proof of that is reflected in the most disturbing case that has shaken social networks recently. I am referring to the viral challenge of Jonathan Galindo, a disturbing game where many youngsters have fallen into unfortunate consequences, which you will see in the following minutes. This will be the cause of the insomnia that you will suffer from tonight. My name is Leonor Clay, and this is The Darkest Secret. Today we present Jonathan Galindo's Macabre Viral Game. Just a few weeks ago, terrible news impacted both Italy and the rest of Europe. In the city of Naples, an 11-year-old boy jumped from the 11th floor of the building where he lived with his family. An unfortunate tragedy that was much commented on in that country. It took on a rugged, dark tint when the police discovered in the child's room a message that he left before making this incomprehensible decision, and that in summary said the following. In the midst of the unbearable sadness that seized them, the child's parents affirmed that they never saw that something strange was happening with him. He was always a happy child, so as most people wondered at the time, what reasons did he have for taking his life like this? For the police, the answer could be hidden behind the enigmatic message that he left. The police investigations in Naples point to viral games that unfortunately, from time to time, circulate on networks. Some that gained attention in the past were Momo and the challenge of the blue whale, being concrete proof of that. However, from this case, the attention of the authorities went back to social networks, and specifically to the game of Jonathan Galindo. The hypothesis of the police indicates that the miner fell into a dangerous network trap which forced him to take his life, thinking that this way he would save his family. In other words, the miner would have been the victim of a sick-minded person who hid behind social networks and made him enter this viral game. But what is this game about? And who is Jonathan Galindo? Jonathan Galindo is nothing more than a name that a user gave this photograph on Facebook for the first time. A stolen photograph belonging to Dusky Sam, an internet user who became popular more than 10 years ago due to his disturbing videos. This man loved costumes. He had hundreds of characters, each with his name and with his personality, but far from simply dressing up to take pictures. This man created the characters to satisfy sexual desires. In fact, his original videos belonged to an adult video site. But among all his characters, his favorite was Larry, a being belonging to the same race as Goofy, a well-known Disney character. Maybe it's because of the original nature that Dusky Sam gave to this character that Jonathan Galindo started doing what he does. Jonathan Galindo's game can reach anyone. It can reach you on Facebook, YouTube, or TikTok. It is a message, a friend request, or any intention of contact coming from a Jonathan Galindo clone account. If you listen to that message, if you open it, if you follow it, the nightmare will begin. First, the person behind the account will try to gain your trust and then begin to send you various tasks that you must perform in an effort to see how far you can go in the game. 
first, they are simple things. Getting up at night, stealing money from your parents, and things like that. But little by little, it leads the kids to perform much darker and macabre challenges. For example, staying away from home one night and worrying your parents. Things that obviously kids no longer want to perform. This is where the drama begins. These evil minds deceive their victims by threatening them, assuring them that if they do not do what they want, they will hurt their family. Children in their purity and innocence unfortunately fall into this trap, and that is how they hurt themselves, pressured by these wicked accounts whose minds of sick people hide behind them and who enjoy the control they have over innocent victims. Recently, more cases have been known about this game, where most of the victims are children, who enter social networks trying to establish friendships through the internet, but end up meeting ruthless people that make them go through hell, in some cases leaving serious psychological consequences due to the terrible experience, but in others, is in the case of the unfortunate death of a child who to this day an entire country continues to mourn. This is why, if you are a parent, you should always be attentive to what your child does on the internet, the places they visit, and the people they talk to. Today the internet is more social than ever, and for some strange reason, these kinds of things are beginning to multiply ever since the known case of the Blue Well from Russia, a disastrous fashion that continues to be encouraged. This is the reason for the making of this video, to inform people about what is happening on social networks, to always be aware of the new adaptions that these types of games have that are so harmful for the little ones. This is why it is better to teach children that they should only accept friendship invitations or talk online with people they know. Nowadays, you cannot leave the internet and all the information it contains within the reach of children. You see, the paranormal is interesting, but sometimes real life is much more alarming, more at hand, and much easier to reach an unwanted level. I hope this video was useful to you because we have come to an end. My name is Leonore Clay, and this was The Darkest Secret. Thank you.